Hi, it's Tammy. Right, so this is part two of when I cut my hair. So part one, I obviously cut it and I've now had it uh, a bit more better trimmed out, shall I say, you know, just so it's all level and neater. Um, that was done about over a week ago since I did that video. Um, and now I'm gonna dye my hair I did say in the comments to let me know, but I, obviously I'm not that well known, so. Um, but I'm dyeing my hair poison. So I've gone, I've decided to go for a red, a dark red colour, as I've never done that one before. I've done purple and blue, but blue just does not like my hair at all. So that just won't stick. And purple, yeah, it's all right, but I fancy doing something different. So, mix some gloves from work. I'm sure they won't miss them. And I'm gonna dye my hair. Now, luckily it's a lot shorter, so it's so much easier to manage. Oh, and I'm gonna take my glasses off, so now I can't see. Uh, but yes, I'm in my bathroom, because I don't wanna get any dye on my bedding. So yeah, so if you can see that, it says poison. So, oh, I love the smell of this. <laughs> so I am going to, ooh, ooh, it's quite a nice red color. So I'm going to just look it on. Yeah, I know I'm not bleaching my hair, so it's not going to show up a lot, but I don't want it to show a lot. I just want it to be a nice hint of red. Just so it's like a, there's a bit of colour in my hair, but not so much that it's overpowering or overpowering, overpower, overpowering. I think I've said that right. <laughs> um, I can't say words today at the minute. Ooh. So I'm going to uh, just dye my hair, plus with work as well, like. They're not strict on what colour hair I dye my hair. Um, but, because I look after elderly people, some of them do get a bit funny, as you can imagine. Which is a good job, I hide my tattoos as well. Because they are very, um, well they're not shy when it comes to being honest. They don't sugarcoat it, that's for sure. So I'm going to uh, see if I can not get any on my face. That would be great. So uh, yes, I donated my hair in the first video to um, Locks of Love. Um, just got to wait for it to get there and for them to send me an email. Most likely to um, send over a certificate of my donation, so that would be nice. I still need to get the one that I did with the little Princess Trust. I still need to get that uh, printed off, because that would be nice to have hung up, I think. So, yeah, I'm not doing any sort of technique, I'm just rubbing it into my hair. And that's, oh, honestly, having short hair over the past week or two has been so nice so much easier to manage when i was in high school i used to have my hair short all the time not this short i did once um but i mostly had it like shoulder length like in a lot of the earlier videos i only started to grow it out because i was like i want to do a good deed i want to donate my hair so instead of just getting it cut all the time i just fancy doing that because i mean I'm sure loads of other people would like to have some hair if and for whatever reason they are not able to. Because I can, for a lot of people, hair is everything. You know, they that's like their whole identity. They, that's what makes them them. You know, everyone's different. I'm not attached to my hair in any way. So, well, I say in any way. I do like my hair, but. You know, I'm not gonna cry because I cut a bit too much off, you know, I'm not. 
so it is what it is but uh oh, i think i've got a bit warm in here but i've already you know oh no oh well oh, i've got my towel that i use for dying oh it's got all red i got it on my arm so but uh, a lot of people at work have really liked my hair because they've never seen it that short before so they were very oh, one of the residents so far it was a boy they were they didn't know if i was a new member of staff or someone who had a haircut so i kept getting taught, called liam for a little bit don't know where liam came from we've never had anyone work with us called liam but we only got one gentleman who works with us and i don't know if he'll be leaving or not because <sighs> works uh been a bit of a pain <clears throat> if you ever want my advice don't work in care <laughs> you don't get paid enough for the shit you deal with so but i there are loads of things i enjoy but there are a lot of things that i definitely don't enjoy and there is a lot more to care than just wiping people's asses and having a cup of tea with them and deal, dealing with medication is a, a lot you got to deal with. So. <laughs> but yeah, that's just a, me having a bit of a rant. Don't mind me. As you can tell, I've been a bit fed up with work. But everyone gets fed up with work. Doesn't matter what kind of job you do. But we definitely don't get paid enough for what we do. We basically do the nurse's job for them as well. We're supposed to be residential, but the amount of people with dementia or other serious health problems that we don't have the equipment or the right kind of training, we get. So, but we often get a lot of families who are they're full capacity. They know they're absolutely fine. They're totally independent, and they're like. They're talking about things that you're like, what earth are you going on about? Because they're that confused and their dementia is awful. But yeah, you can tell they're like, not right, but who are we to say we're just carers? So I think that's enough dye in my hair. I think I've, I don't know if I've got all of it or not. I'm just gonna just uh, rub it in a bit. <laughs> right, so I'm gonna leave this in for a bit, and then when I wash it out, I will show you the finished results. Otherwise, this video is gonna go on for a very long time. So I'll see you in a bit, okay? Hi, so I let it sit in and I wash it out. Um, it's still a little bit damp, but I can definitely see a redness in it. So I'm very happy about that. Don't know if it can see on camera. Uh, obviously the lighting's not the best, so not much I can do about that as it is night time now as of recording this but yeah it's still a bit damp but I'm very happy with with it it's definitely shown through as got a red tint to it which is what I wanted because I didn't want to bleach my hair and I didn't want it to be super super bright I just wanted it so I can see a bit of red in it so uh, yeah, that's basically it for this video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it anyway. So that's basically all I got to say about it. <laughs> but um, I would show it with it being more dry, but I'm just not patient. <laughs> but anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you again in, I don't know what video I'm gonna make next, but we'll see. So I'll see you next one.